My name is Gail Griffiths. I'm from Corindai in New South Wales. Because I had severe emphysema 18 months ago and I had no choice but to quit. It was making me very sick. My lungs went right down to 10% lung volume. I just couldn't give up before then and having family that smoke around you and all around you, it's just an everyday social thing to do. Well, I got on those Champix that the government provided and they are wonderful. I'd recommend them to anybody. You know, if I can give it up through those tablets, anyone can. Oh, I've got a second chance in life from quitting smoking. I ended up having a double lung transplant 12 months ago. And um, that's the reason why I had to quit smoking too, to be even considered. I would have died because my lungs were just slowly deteriorating. I want to be around and see my grandchildren. You know, I'm 55 years old. I've still got a life ahead of me, you know. I'm still young, you know. So there's no turning back. And since I've quit smoking and I had the double lung transplant, my life's changed, you know. I do it for my family. I tell my children, don't smoke. It's, it can be hereditary. Look, my twin brother and I, I didn't know I was going to end up like this five years ago in this situation and it's really turned my whole life around. You're surrounded by smokers in the family. No one tells you about smoking. Well, I was never told about smoking when I grew up. You know, you're just being seen and not heard, you know. You had to just stay away from adults, but no one encouraged you to well, sit down with you and talk about smoking. Not like now. Back when I was young, it, it was just the in thing to smoke. That's why a lot of our people now are dying of smoking related diseases because we're never told anything when we were young, you know. Stay healthy and stay away from the cigarettes, you know, all the time, you know. After this transplant, you know, I wouldn't want people to go for a lung transplant, but it's very traumatic. Mm -hmm. it's and it's only 12 months ago because I was in a wheelchair prior to this. I just want to encourage people not to smoke at all.